there, my name is Stacy Jensen from Color Veil, and I would like to show you how to use the paint on sharpening action with inside of quite a few of our sets. We find this action so important in editing that we try not to forget it. It is in the Only for the Bold. This photo I created is by Ellie Willette. Here is the before and here is the after of the edit. We did a previous video on how to get there. But next I want to show you how to really highlight her hair and her eyes. So we're going to scroll down to the finishing touches and click on the paint on spot highlighter and sharpener and click play. This is not just a sharpening action. It does so much more than that. What we do is we click play. It's going to have an inverted mask that is black, meaning all of it is hidden. We're going to click on the brush, the paint brush. Make sure that your opacity is at 100%, your flow is at 100%. We need to switch over to black, or I'm sorry, white, so that we can reveal areas. I'm going to make a larger brush. We do not have to be perfect in this brush, so we're just going to grab a bigger one. We're going to go a little bit smaller. You can actually paint this over your entire subject if you want, but you have to then take the sharpening layer off of their skin. For this one, we're keeping it on just the hair. Then we're going to get a smaller brush, paint it over the eyes, paint it over the next eye, paint it over the lips. Very important. You'll see it makes it look like a little lip gloss. We're going to change our opacity to 50%. So here at 50, and then we're going to get it a little smaller and brush over her eyebrows. Once we're done with that, we want to click on the sharpener layer. Sorry about that, I accidentally dragged it. Click on the sharpener layer, and then drag the opacity of that down to a very natural state so that everything um, just looks beautiful, crisp, and sharp. And let me show you the before. So if you watch her eyes and her hair, the before and the after, the before and the after. Thank you so much for watching.